The first final week is behind lawmakers at the Iowa State House, and new at five, Republicans and Democrats have vastly different takes on how the legislative session is going. Republicans have control of the House and the Senate, and our governor is a Republican. They have been able to move quickly on several bills the governor has signed into law, including one that requires schools to give families the option of 100% in-person attendance, and the bill that limits the window for absentee voting. I think we've done a great job on the things uh, that are more policy related. Now we're going to start moving into the things that have some uh, appropriation and some tax impacts on them. But uh, I feel really good about where we're at right now. This session has failed to grasp the moment that we're in and has used that this uh, opportunity instead to do a lot of partisan uh, legislation like we talked about earlier with, you know, the defund the, the police thing and things like that. Democrats today said Iowa has failed to provide any meaningful coronavirus relief on the state level, and they applauded President Biden's $1.9 trillion package.